Hello there YouTube and today I'm bringing you some GTA 4 and in this uh, sort of tutorial I'm going to teach you guys how to become a cop. So first thing is first um, on the Xbox 360 you don't have any mods to become a cop with so you're gonna have to first uh, obviously get a cop car illegally and you can do this by on the map where I show you it's a little bit north of the area um, I think it's called the Northern Gardens area um, so you can get here. Once you're here, it's a little police station here. Uh, you're going to have to try to break into one of those cars and steal it. And obviously there's a police officer right there. So you want to sort of steal this cop car without, um, you know, attracting too much attention and having a shit ton of uh, police on you. So what I do here, you know, the car's taking a little bit to start up. But I um, steal it and I'm directly running out of there. Uh... So that's, you know, it's an option of how to steal it. You don't need to go to the police station. You can steal any random cop car you see. But the only thing is that uh, you, most of the times, you might have to kill the actual officers. And that might increase your one level, like, tenfold. And with this, you just have to get out of the area in, you know, in time. And you're safe. So once you're the, in a safe spot, press LB on the Xbox. And you can, you can view through the most wanted or the current crimes. So, uh you can have a chance to do these and you know whatever mission you want to do whether it's a current crime or you want to just catch a most wanted then do it so what I do now is I'm gonna go to the current crimes and I'm gonna select you know uh, a criminal criminal on foot at whatever street so I press A to select that mission that whatever cop mission and once you do this uh, it will sell a path will appear on your little mini map there in which you can then chase it and I think my siren automatically um, turned on so which was pretty cool uh, I wasn't paying attention and ran into this wall but uh, for the criminal and foot ones for the current crimes these are current crimes which means these are crimes going on right now which you, get, you can get into and the most wanted I'll do after this so for this one I see the criminal um, he is running away on foot he pulls out a gun and I'm gonna press you know LB or whatever to uh, to shoot my gun at him and I do kill him and it saved my game because you do get like I think I forget what achievement or whatever this is called um, what sort of reward you do get for acting like a cop in this game uh, Xbox 360 version I'll double check on that and post it in the description after this um, but uh yeah so it's pretty nice uh, those are the current crimes they change literally every time you try to select it so you can keep on going back and forth if you want to do the current crimes. Um, right now I'm testing the police backup. Police backup I'm not as familiar with but I believe after a certain amount of time there's going to be a few more police cars that show up to the scene and actually I believe that you know if you're doing a gang related mission you can call for backup if there's like 10 guys you have to take out and you can't do it by yourself. Um, but other than that I'm going to probably test out the most wanted missions now. Um, one of these missions so again guys there is I believe there is a mod for this you can like put it on the USB and install it into your Xbox 360 but uh, what I'm just showing is a sort of role play as a police officer um, for GTA 4 not exactly you know getting the uniform and you know actually being in the LCPD so I do do this um, this most wanted mission what I did was I selected whatever the first guy was I forget what charges he had but then I press A and it goes to his location. So I'm going to head there now and I'm going to take him out. And you know, you get reward, you might get some money or you know, it might be a good way to increase your uh, you know, awareness. But um yeah, again guys, there is a mod for this if you have the PC version. I know you can do a lot more with the PC version than on the Xbox 360. But obviously, you know, it's a little this is all you can really do unless you do get the USB and install it um, for the Xbox 360. This is all. You know, it's still fun doing all these missions, taking out all the most wanted. So I do manage to uh, get this guy and kill him right here. Yep, and I do kill him, and it saves, which means that you completed that little mini mission. So yeah, guys, uh, this is pretty much it. Thank you for watching. And please do stay tuned and subscribe for more. I might be posting more GTA Cop videos in the future. 
So, uh, yeah, I'm out, guys.